For nearly a decade, with our nation at war in Afghanistan and Iraq, you, our troops, veterans, and your families, have borne the burden of America's security. Indeed, many of you were required to remain on active duty beyond your scheduled discharge date. For you and your families, stop loss meant even more sacrifice. Now your country wants to recognize your extraordinary service. Under legislation I signed into law last year, you may be entitled to special retroactive pay. If you served between September 11, 2001 and September 30, 2009, and your service was involuntarily extended or your retirement was suspended due to stop loss, you are eligible. It's $500 per month, and the tens of thousands of veterans who've already been approved have received an average of nearly $4,000. But now the deadline is approaching fast, and if you don't apply by October 21st, you'll miss out. I know there's been some confusion and skepticism out there. Some veterans think this is some sort of gimmick or scam, or that it's a way for the government to call you back to service. Nothing could be further from the truth. As your Commander-in-Chief, I'm here to tell you that this is no gimmick or trick. You worked hard. You earned this money. It doesn't matter whether you were active or reserve, whether you're a veteran who experienced stop loss or the survivor of a service member who did. If your service was extended, you are eligible. You served with honor. You did your duty. And when your country called on you again, you did your duty again. Now it's time to collect that special pay that you deserve. To learn more or to submit your application, just go to www.defense.gov slash stoploss. I'm going to repeat that, www.defense.gov slash stoploss. It's easy, it's quick, and you could receive your pay in a matter of weeks. It's that simple. But you have to apply, and you have to do it by October 21st. So go online, submit your application, spread the word, and share this video among your fellow veterans. Help us get our stop-loss veterans the pay to which they're entitled. Help us make sure that America is serving our veterans and your families as well as you have served us. Thank you very much.